Eliana, Julian Assange, does the president believe Julian Assange should be prosecuted? I haven't discussed that with the president. We just know we just know that for us there was no Russia collusion, especially in the winning part of the campaign, which I managed. Um, and the president is absolutely right. We've been talking about this for a year and a half, close to two years now, millions of dollars of later, millions of dollars later, um, 33 people have complied, 1.4 million. The president and his lawyers are complying. So hopefully uh, Mr. Mueller and his team are getting the answers they seek and we'll wind this down soon and, and uh, we'll let the chips fall where they may for people like Mr. Assange, but I don't have a comment on that. I have nothing to do with them. So the president wants to see firsthand what we all know is um, historic devastation and loss by way of the, these California wildfires. Um, I'm sure that he'll be thanking the very brave men and women who are running toward the fires to try to rescue rescue people and their um, in their homes and around the campfire and certainly to talk to those who have lost loved ones and perhaps to meet with officials. I think the itinerary is still being worked out, but uh, the president will be in California tomorrow. Julian, what's the president's position on the CNN lawsuit? Oh, he's made very clear. I think you could read the president's lawyer's briefs, um, the White House brief on what the position is. But um, as far as I could tell, CNN hasn't had any damages. They're still anti-Trump most of the day. So um, I, I see a number of CNN people here. You, they've got press passes. They're here. So I don't really have a comment on it. Elections. I have many takeaways from the midterm elections. I will tell you that um, elections aside, it is the role, role of the United States Congress under the Constitution to make the laws. How does he know that? First Lady you know, weighed in in such a public fashion. We, we heard that that might have frustrated him. And the First Lady have an, an excellent working relationship, an excellent personal relationship. And by that I mean she is someone who offers her opinion. And he trusts her enormously also to offer that opinion. I've worked with both of them. I, I think they're both just brilliant and committed to this country and its peace and its prosperity. And I think this country is much better off that they're President and First Lady. Rather than